Greetings, I'm Lou Hablis, and I'm here to help you pass the CISSP exam by teaching you how to correctly read and understand CISSP questions and pick the best answer. Here's the question we're going to analyze. Which of the following options is best for authenticating employee access to different applications within a company's environment? In order to understand this question and be able to identify the best answer, we need to simplify the question and identify the keywords. The first keyword is authenticating, which means verifying a subject's, a user's identity via knowledge, ownership, or characteristic. The next keywords are different applications, which implies that we're looking for a single sign-on solution, a solution that allows a user to sign on once and be authenticated to use multiple applications. The final keywords are within a company's environment, which implies that we don't need a federated identity management solution. So we're looking for a single sign-on, an SSO, solution for use within a company's network domain. With this insight, let's examine the answers and determine the best answer to the question. At first glance, answers A, B, C, and D all appear to be correct answers. They are all some form of single sign-on solution. Answer D, LDAP, however, serves more in a supporting role relative to single sign-on to provide authorization and is therefore commonly used in conjunction with single sign-on applications like Kerberos. For example, once Kerberos authenticates a user, LDAP's extensive lookup capabilities can refer to the directory access database to determine the specific capabilities and data the user will be authorized to access. And while LDAP functionality includes efficient password management as well as simple authentication needs relative to more secure single sign-on solutions, LDAP can be more easily misconfigured and passwords, for example, can be more easily snooped. So we can safely eliminate answer D as the best answer. Let's now look at answers A, B, and C, Kerberos, SAML, and OAuth. Kerberos is a single sign-on solution, pervasively used within corporate environments and therefore an excellent option. SAML, another single sign-on solution, is used primarily in the context of federated identity management solutions. SAML could be used in the context of a single large network security domain, but it was specifically designed to enable sign-on capabilities across disparate security domains. In other words, Think of it like bringing in a backhoe to perform a, a task that only requires a small shovel. And importantly, SAML is not as pervasively built into as many operating systems and applications as Kerberos. Like Kerberos and SAML, OAuth is also a federated identity management solution, but it's even less of a fit here. It's been designed for federated identity management across the internet, not for SSO within a company. It is not a good answer at all. After a brief examination, it looks like Kerberos is the best solution, and this makes sense when we consider that Kerberos has been around since the 1980s, and Microsoft incorporated Kerberos-based authentication as the default authentication method in Microsoft Windows, as well as made it an integral part of Windows Active Directory and, by extension, corporate networks worldwide. In fact, Kerberos integration and support can be found in all major operating systems, including Windows, Mac OS, and Linux. The correct answer is answer A, Kerberos. By the way, if you'd like to learn more about Kerberos, check out our deep dive explanation linked here and in the description below. Thank you for watching this video. If you're preparing for the CISSP exam, my colleagues Rob Witcher, John Birdie, myself, and our team have been helping professionals like you prepare to confidently pass the challenging CISSP exam for more than 20 years. We love guiding folks to become better security professionals and to achieve the coveted and well-respected CISSP certification along the way. If you're interested in finding out more about our CISSP Masterclass, please check us out here at DestinationCISSP.com. And if you found this video helpful, you can hit the thumbs up button 
And if you want to be notified when we release additional videos in this question and strategy series, please subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notifications. Thanks very much for watching and all the best in your studies.